I'm, you have, I'm her kid. You're her kid? Oh my god! How cute is she? All right. Now, let me ask you this. Uh, and do you have kids of your own? No, I do not. You do not. And was she a trouble as a little toddler? No. No. Because, you know, when they're little, uh, really little, you've got to think of shit to do with them all day long, don't you? You have to entertain those little things all day long. Well, my kids were little. I took them to the library, went to the park, ran the sprinklers, grabbed the slides, bought a movie, got home, looked at my watch, 10 a.m. 10 a.m. I want to shrug out my window, but I can't even kill myself when I need to. I'm up a ranch. It's like, oh, shit, I landed. Okay. Uh, and then, uh, you know, you think you're going to miss them when they go to school, right? Whose kids are in school? You know. No. Then, right? Yellow school bus shows up. You're like, hey, don't let the door hit you on the way out. <laughs> Who runs to that goddamn bus? Don't you look back and cry, you son of a bitch! <laughs> Mommy's gonna watch a show with us at Disney or Barney or Full House and all of twin wiggles and I'm getting a Jack and Coke and I'm saying, thank you, Jesus! The only ass I have to wipe today is my own. Get on that bus. See you in seven hours, bitches, sir. <laughs> No longer a planet, you know. Okay, you know that. And math, you gotta know like division. It's like crazy. And you gotta know where, where uh, Maine is. Do you know what? Do you know where Maine is? My daughter's seven. She comes up to me. She goes, Ma, where's Maine? I go, I don't know. She goes, You don't know? I go, You don't fucking know either. <laughs> but she was upset because she thought her mother had all the answers. I said, Mommy doesn't have all the answers. I married your father. Didn't I? Now, come on. <laughs> so, uh, but here's the thing. I got a daughter who's a uh, uh, teenager, and we live with my fiance, Kevin, and he tries to get her to clean her room, and she goes, I don't have to listen to you, Kevin. She goes, you're not my real father. He goes, yeah, you're right. And since I'm not your real father, I don't have to pay for your car or your phone or your computer. She said, oh, daddy. <laughs> You ever borrow money from your kids? Come on, be honest. <laughs> they get that damn Christmas money and you've got like a Con Ed bill. You're like, shit, honey. Woo! Yeah, you're paying back. You're paying back, right? <laughs> but, you know, you know things are rough when you owe your kid $500 and she's in the third grade. Okay. <laughs> Hard to get your kid to obey when you owe him money. I'm like, hey, wash the dishes. She's like, I bought the dishes. You got to wash them. <laughs> So I did it. And then I cleaned her room because I needed gas money. <laughs> so I have a daughter in middle school. Were you nice in middle school or were you bitching? Very nice. That's like my older, my, I got the one sassy one and then a very sweet one. My one of sweet is in middle school. Okay, 14. This one, and my, and my kid's cute. She's cute, but she wears braces, right? So this one girl would make fun of my daughter every day. She's like, you're ugly with braces. You're a poser because you dress like a skater, but you're really a brainiac. You're ugly with braces. <laughs> My kid gets off the bus crying, right? She's crying. I'm like, that's it. That's it. What does she look like? And my daughter goes, I don't want to be mean. And I said, well, I do. <laughs> Mommy's mean. What does the bitch look like? She goes, she's heavy. I said, yeah. <laughs> she goes, and she has a funny eye. I swear to God, I'm making this up. I go, what do you mean? She goes, one eye goes that way, and the other eye goes that way. I said, honey, don't you see? This is a gift from God. He wants you to go get her. You say, back off, you fat-ass, lazy-eyed bitch, and you look at me when I talk to you. So, uh, some mothers say, turn the other cheek. I say, it's an eye for a lazy goddamn eye. And then you can surpass you at a certain point. They just surpass you. My kid, my teenage is smarter than me, stronger than me, and my 15-year-old actually has bigger boobs than me. You know, which is especially upsetting because he's a boy. Uh, you know. So here's the deal. I'm walking down the street with my teenage daughter. This guy behind us is cat calling, right? He's like, hey, yeah, come here, come here. No, come here. Oh, yeah, come on. I'm like, hey, which one of the two of us are you treating like a piece of meat? Please say it's me. Please, God, just pick me just once. But no, he's looking at my daughter like she's a juicy leg of lamb, right? And me like I'm a dried up old chicken wing with E. coli, you know. I can't compete with my daughter because she's younger and sexier than me. So now whenever I want to feel sexy, right, I guess 
visit my mom in the nursing home. That's where I go. Because there I'm the hot girl. I am. Look at me, fellas. I walk without a limp. Look at that. Look at that. No hump or catheter. Woo! Kids, kids, kids. 